Hello everybody and welcome to Mission 15 Battle in the Clouds. This is the final episode, hopefully, if I don't fail, of the Star Wars Battlefront Let's Play. And I am quite happy because if I manage it then that's me finished. But I'll save any happy feelings for whether or not I do actually manage to win. So here we go, Battle in the Clouds. This is the map I did my introductory video on. We have recaptured Cloud City, but now we have to secure the outlying mining platforms. Remember, pilots will automatically repair whatever vehicle they're currently piloting. Use the fighter craft to attack the enemy from behind. Don't make a single joke, guys. <laughs> so yeah, this is the... Oh, skip that. Sorry, can't watch that. Uh, well, I won't be skipping cutscenes in other games that I play through that maybe aren't so copyrighted. Like Kezen, for example, I won't be skipping cutscenes in that because that's not like a major film franchise. <laughs> so yeah, this is the map I did my introductory video on. So we're revisiting it, except we're playing as the rebels, not the clones. But yeah, I'm going to show off some aerial combat like I promised I would when I got to this. And hopefully it means I won't die and lose, but I don't think it will. So, first things first, destroy the vehicles before they even get off. The air and to the seriously, do it. It's the best way. There. Now you severely weakened their air superiority before they've even got half the planes in the air. Okay, don't want to die. After me saying how I play lots of uh, flying games and how it's my stronger point, I don't want to die. So there we go. There we go. And flying in this in this level is fun. Seriously. Oh, we collision there. It's okay. We're both okay. But you're not okay now. You're dead now, but that's okay, because I'm not dead. And you're dead too. So, this level actually makes flying fun. In all the other levels, flying is not that fun. Uh, it really doesn't feel like any other levels were designed for flying. Uh, it feels like the flying was just tacked on as an afterthought, really. But for this, this level was the opposite. This level feels like it was totally designed for um, flying, which makes, I guess that's why flying feels so natural in this level. I'm going to leave that guy alone because he's evading me. Oh, uh, sorry if you heard that, that's my phone going off. Sorry if you heard that, I hope I don't have to pause the recording and answer it. I hope they will take the hint. I'm not getting any kills. Where? You know what? I know exactly what my mum was throwing for as well. Um, I told her I was going. Oh. Okay, here we go. We've lost the command post, so we're not doing too good, but we're, we're, we're kind of catching up considering that they had like a 50 head start on us. We're doing, we're doing alright. So, your first priority should be the bombers. Uh, obviously, because the bombers can obviously bomb your troops. Obviously. <laughs> I'm stating obvious. Okay. Yeah. Just going to focus on off. continuously uh, taking these things that I might have to swap tactics because I do not want to lose. I want to win on my first goal. Uh, and sometimes if you focus too much on the air fight, the enemy forces on the ground can overwhelm your, your forces that's on the ground. And obviously you don't want that to happen. Ah, he's dead. Finally got him. Let's turn around. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no boost. I keep on forgetting I'm not in Star Wars Battlefront 2. Star Wars Battlefront 2, by the way, is so much better with regards to flying. I mean, the space missions, they are so fun. I'll, okay, fair enough, they can get a bit repetitive if you follow the same strategy to win all the time, but still, it's quite fun for the first few times you do it, anyway. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to swap tactics. Let's come down here and try and take it. If we take it, then that's good. It's obvious, well, for obvious reasons why it's good. Don't kill me, don't kill me. Love how he just sits and stays on there, despite the fact that I'm clearly taking over this command post. And you've got it, let's go into the air. And head over here, and do the same over here. If I can. Hopefully. And he's taking it back. I feel like this is going to be a good game of cat and mouse. We've lost the command post. Die! Seriously, die. Enemy forces 
Let's capture it back. Oh, this is not going well. I'm not gonna. You know what? My I think my best post. bet is to stay up in the and fight because we seriously we've managed to catch up. So maybe I uh, maybe I was actually onto something with taking it out to the air. Oh, that guy's got me in his sight because I. Okay. Good thing about uh, pilots is they will repair. Come on, as I'm talking about it, we've repair. Repair, please. Repair, so I don't die. They will repair the vehicles as you're in them, which is great for this mission. And I'm dead. Okay, I think I've done enough aero combat. I do not want to risk uh, losing, so I'm going to go as a marksman and I'm going to start pushing up here now. Here probably needs my help. Oh, he was targeting me, that sniper. I've seen you. Yeah, it got messaged. Oh, it's okay, I'll wait until after the video. Oh, oh Wookie! I just bounced my grenade off your head. Okay. No, you're not you're not sniping me, I'm sniping you. I am the snake master here. I will get grenade though. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Ah, oh, come on. Yes. No! Yes. Whoa. Ah. <laughs> that was a... Uh, a bunch of random noises there. I don't. I don't even ask. <laughs> God, that laugh was loud as well. I hope I didn't blow out my microphone. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> oh well. There we go. Whoa. Too busy checking my audacity there. Oh yeah, I use audacity to record. Um, just let you know if any of you's curious. It's quite a good recording program. Uh, and I use uh, Arcsoft Showbiz to capture my game footage. It came with my uh, Easy Gamer recording device thing. Oh, and that is just a bunch of grenades. Just chuck our grenades up there and get them over the ridge. Don't go over the ridge as I see I'm going to chuck grenades over the ridge, that's just stupid. And what are you doing? You're kamikaze. Oh, I see what you were doing. You were distracting me so I could get hit with a grenade, weren't you? And you, you're just hoping that you don't get shot, but you get shot. Enemy in range. Oh, no scope. Oh, you're not getting me with your crazy grenade. Yeah. You're not getting me with your crazy bullets. Maybe you are getting me with your crazy grenade then. <laughs> okay, still don't feel comfortable enough to go back on the aerial offense. I mean, we're not ahead, but not by that much. I mean, you are got you guys also what happened on Kashik, so you know that it can change in the blink of an eye. Yeah, I'm so disappointed with Kashik still. I mean, I could have won this whole game without losing a single battle. Kashik had to happen. Maybe I'm. Is it Kashik or is it Kashik? I don't know. It's probably Kashik. I've probably been saying it wrong this entire time. And diehard Star Wars fans are probably wanting to slap me in the face. <laughs> Enemy in range. Take cover. Die. Okay, I'm feeling a bit more confident now. We are, I mean, we're in the 110s. That was a terrible grenade. And they're in the 80s. Hostile ahead. I'm right here. Oh, <laughs> you went flying. Alright. Alright. Come on. I'll pistol you to death. That sounds terrible. Pistol you to death? Really? Now we're starting to push them back. Properly now. Okay, if we can come in here and take this, we'll push them back to the landing depots, which is pretty good. That's what we want to do. They're all up there, so we can just sneak in here while well, they're distracted fighting our forces up there. And hopefully, no, he's gonna try and stop us. And fail to stop us at that. The reinforcements have been cut off. Oh, and here we go. You're noticing what we're doing. Still failed though. I'm happy with that. Keep on failing, guys. Keep on failing. Okay, we've got the control. No, I'm getting hit. Someone somewhere is trying to. Oh, he's up there. Oh, oh, he got me. Ah. No, it was you! Okay. Oh, why did I spawn in here? That's probably going to cost me that spawn point, isn't it? Because I never packed out the proper spawn point. Jeez. Looking at it. 
Oh. Damn. Okay. So, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? They pretty much have the air. Yeah, yeah, I'll go back in the air for a bit. I mean, I like the air, I really do. Wait, where's. There was. I swear there was a X Wing over here. Someone took it, didn't they? <sighs> Stole my bud. As in my, you know, aircraft. Not my girlfriend. My girlfriend hates getting called Bird, actually. She really does hate it. I mean, I can see why. I mean, Bird. I mean, really? I mean, I've never called any. I've never called a girlfriend of mine Bird. <laughs> I've never. I've never seen why you would do that. They're not a Bird. They're a girl. Seriously. Anyway. We can get this if someone doesn't take it, and then we can go back up into the air and destroy them, because I love doing that. I love flying games. I'm actually going to do the entire Ace Combat series, well, as much as I can get my hands on. I believe I have every single one. I have Distant Thunder, I have a uh, 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 Squadron Meter, I have a uh, Belkin War, I have Fires of Liberation, and I have Assault Horizon. Now, so I think I have them all. Look at you try to flee the battlefield to get away from me. It's not going to work, pal. It's not going to work. Ah, there we go. And I'm going to get him. You can't even lock on. Oh, I did a lot of damage there. Too used to Star Wars Battlefront 2. So this is a bit of a close fight, as I expect. I mean, it is the last fight in the game. The last fight in the Galactic Clone. You, I don't know where the hell you're going, but I am not going to follow you. And if we go in here, we can see some classic Star Wars. There's the pole that Luke hung off. Hung off. Oh, that I bashed off. <laughs> or is it that one? Or is it that one? I don't know what one is. <sighs> give in, Empire. Give in. You're losing. We win. End of story. You're not making a comeback. Not now. Oh, and there's a Y-Wing. You can pilot the Y-Wing as well. Let's just go over here and help this guy. What are you doing? I hear something. Do you? Really? It took you that long to hear something? <laughs> We've captured a command post. Sorry, I'm taking this one. Oh. Don't know what happened there. Come over We've here. Captured a command post. Ah, no need to do that. <laughs> you took it already. Ah, I got it. That was fun. So we pretty much won. And now I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with how this Let's Play turned out. For my first ever Let's Play, I feel like it went okay. Uh, I'm not saying it was amazing or anything like that, but I mean, uh, I went okay. Obviously there's bits I could improve on. Uh, but, for a first Let's Play, I'm pretty happy with it, to be fair. Um, I'm looking forward to doing more, I really am. I mean, seriously, I have literally spent the last, maybe, like, five, six days just recording everything in my spare time. The uni, seeing my girlfriend, and reading Percy Jackson books. Percy Jackson books, I'm going to wreck it. If you're into Greek mythology, then please, just pick up Percy Jackson books by Rick Riordan. They are an amazing read, especially if you're into Greek mythology. So here we go, my final kill, kill death ratio is 52 kills to 6 deaths with 4 command points captured. That is, and that, that, this is my final personal stats. And these are the final player awards, I know I never paid attention to them for the entire Let's Play, apart from like my first video, but still, nostalgia, well not nostalgia, that's not the word. <sighs> Just, I have them feels, you know, I have them feels. I really do. <laughs> So I'm assuming there's going to be a celebration cutscene that we were not going to get to watch, thanks to it probably being copyrighted. This mission oh! Is our last hope Aww. To take down the I we was completely wrong. Now I feel like a complete and total idiot. I totally forgot about the Battle of Endor. Damn. For some reason I thought... Oh, damn. <sighs> well. I feel like a complete idiot now. Oh, and that means that it doesn't, you know, my introduction video, final video, episode 15, maybe I can just like forget about the battle, <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm not going to forget about the battle window. Oh, I feel a bit gutted, but oh well, what can you do? 
fucking idiot really. <laughs> but here we go, Battle of Endor, next video. So as always you can follow me on Twitter. My Twitter handle is at Ridders, R-U-D-E-R-Z-Z. -Z. Spell for that is on my channel if you didn't catch that. And uh, feel free to leave a like and a comment. It really encourages me to make more videos and it makes me feel better knowing that you are liking and commenting and stuff. Thank you if you do. And if you're feeling very generous, please subscribe. Uh, thank you very much if you do, do choose to subscribe to me and I really do appreciate it if you do. Feel free to message me at any time. I'm an easy going guy. Feel free to do that. So thank you everyone for watching and I'll see you in the last and final, <laughs> final video. Thank you very much. See you later.